All right, so this is the block part of it. And over here, we will code all the things that we need um, to make the application um, uh, useful. So uh, the first thing I did is initialize two variables. And you can create variables by clicking over here. And these one are global variables. And, um, and then I initialize them to zero, which is right here. Then I click on the screen one. Screen one is right around here, uh, here. There we go. And um, when screen one initializes, I want to set the activity starter want that action to and this string over here. So basically what this does is it will turn on the Bluetooth um, component, the Bluetooth application in my uh, app. Uh, to have a little bit more understanding of this, we can simply Google the activity starter, which is over here and I will tell you what it is and here the action request enable is is basically um, an activity action that uh, shows a system activity that allows the user to turn on the Bluetooth alright so that's basically what I'm doing right there let's go back to uh, here, here. okay so we have to put this code there. All right, next thing I'm doing is I set the global joystick base center to, uh, and I put the joystick X plus joystick radius. Remember uh, from previous that this is 50 and this value is 50. And we can double check that by going back to it. Uh, we are on, uh, what that was joystick so let's go to joystick which is this one X is 50 and radius is 50 so the value of that variable is 100 same thing for the next one and the last thing I did over here is I initialized the X value to 0 and the Y value also that means that this X right here which is the X value will be 0 and this one will be 0 when the screen one initializes. Okay, the next thing we do is we um, will program the list picker one. So basically, when list picker before picking, do set list picker one that element to Bluetooth client address and names. So that's the first thing it will do. And the second thing is after I pick the Bluetooth that I want to pair with, right? This com this component over here is going to show me a list of all the Bluetooth available. And uh, in my case, once that I click on the list um, picker, I I selected the HC06, which is my Bluetooth device. But you will see other Bluetooth available. Um, after picking, what we do. What we will do is we'll call Bluetooth client one connect address to list picker selection. Okay, and you can get this block right on Bluetooth client, and you can look at it over here. And if that's true, then set button one that enable to truth. And something that I changed previously is here bottom one previously I had this enable but I just checked it off and then if that if it's connected to the Bluetooth it will uh, make it available for the user to click on it all right and that's that and then the last thing I did is um, when clicking on the button button one right I'm going to disconnect the Bluetooth and I'm gonna again disable the button. Alright, so this is what we have cooking 
Ah, funcionaba. 